Hey guys, I'm going to show you my uh, rain barrel setup. I uh, put me a couple ten footers up on the roof. And run her down here. And cut the top out of the barrel about four inches. And cut the uh, rim or the gutter off of it and uh, flipped it upside down shoved it down in there and I drilled a bunch of quarter inch holes and uh, put uh, biochar in it first put a layer to cover up the holes and then I've got some river rock to hold the biochar down it'd probably wash out so then I got it running down to that and I got it daisy chained from there over to my second one, if you can see that. Haven't finished painting that yet. And then I'm on a daisy chain. I got quite a few barrels. I'm just gonna go all the way down here. And then from the other end, I'm going to, I'm gonna put this IBC tote down under it and then give me I got about five more of them I'm gonna hook them together and uh, my brother stole the cage off that I'm gonna have to as well as going dry and he borrowed one of the toes when they gave me back it had a uh, cage on it I got it back it looked like that I'm gonna find out where he li I know where he lives and there's a yeah, one of my grow barrels upside down uh, over here we got some uh, candy onions in one of my grow barrels. They're not doing too bad. I topped them a little bit. They were going, uh, growing a little bit too fast. You want to kind of, if they start growing real fast, you want to top them off a little bit so they'll they'll bulb and bulb will get bigger. They won't go to seed as fast. But uh, see what else I'm gonna show you. Oh, I come over from the other house with one of my grow barrels. It's got a blueberry bush in it. I about beat it to death. I had a garbage bag over it, but it tore the tips off of them. I don't know if you can see those. But down here, it's getting some blueberries on it. I'm going to have to get me another one of these bushes. I didn't think they'd grow very good here in a grow barrel, but they're doing pretty good. So, well, let's see, what else, what else? Oh, wood chips, yeah, out there. I got, I don't, I don't till no more. I got, I'm getting too old and that tiller like to beat me to death. So I, uh, build me some raised beds. I, these first two rows were tilled and I said, that's enough. I put my tomatoes in those and then I'll build me some raised beds. Just go get some compost. And then out here we got my grass. It's growing. I mowed that first mow. This is four acres. So I divided it up two and two. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to have them bale that. And because uh, it was beating me and my mower up. And I'm a tough old bird, but it was beating the, you know what, out of me. So we're going to bale it. And I got brother in law's got horses. and he'll like some free bales so I'm gonna give that to my uncle he's gonna go down to Texas he goes to Texas every winter and he said he got a trailer down there he says I'll take that I said well I don't use it you can have her so well see you later